that looked like it was running that looked like it was running let's see yeah it is oh it feels like a good one oh maybe oh dang i think our first one was a good one look at that stay on Last time I was over here at Rotary was a few days ago with my buddy Terry, the day he left. I was throwing this worm right here, which is the uh, Power Bait Power Worm 7 inch in a uh, blue flake. Might be a little hard to see this time in the morning. <laughs> but this thing is shredded, no tail anymore. The last thing I did was catch a, uh, like a five pounder on this one here. So that one is toast. What I'm gonna do is start with a new one. That was on my Texas rig. I've got a, uh, a number four aught here, quarter ounce weight, and I am pegging it. Uh, the other thing I like to do with these hooks now is I just kind of grab them like this and I bend them either towards me or away. And it kind of just offsets it a little bit if you can see that. I find that definitely helps my hookup ratio. But over here, these, these bass have been really, really liking these power bait worms. You know, like the ribbon tails. This is a seven inch. I've also been throwing the Gogan Mondo 10 inch worm. I was using that here the other day. Caught a bunch of fish on it, but uh, I'm down to one left on that. Another good one here we've got is uh, this one here. So this one, which is in the uh, Tequila Sunrise works really good and then I also have another red power bait worm so these are the three I'm basically going to be throwing today and then I also brought the Geeka rig just in case I want to throw something a little smaller probably the Margarita Mutilator which is doing really good I'm going to try to stick with these we'll start with this one here see if we can't get ourselves a bite here first thing in the morning so this past weekend, I was over at Dwarf Shack with my buddy Terry. We fished uh, about a day and a half over there. When I mean a day and a half, the first day we fished 15 straight hours. And then the second day we went back and fished another five or so. Caught a ton of smallmouth. Um, see, there we go, our first blow up over there. Um, caught a ton of smallmouth. Nothing too crazy, like the first day Got a couple two pounders, but the rest were around one pounders. Uh, the second day, got 27 and one 3.69 was our best. But we found that because it was so hot, it was around 104 to 105 both days. Uh, they were in about 30 to 50 feet of water. And we decided to switch over to using the drop shot. And we were using little white TRDs and purple and green pumpkin, but the white flake shad colored one little trd by z-man just throwing it deep and working it slow was doing the job at least this time of year didn't film at all because uh, it was just too dang hot even the coolers that i had in the back my little cooler just uh couldn't hold up on those longer days oh ooh, ooh. that looked like it was running that looked like it was running let's see yeah it is oh it feels like a good one. Oh, maybe oh dang i think our first one was a good one look at that stay on wow we might have gotten a nice one here to start the day definitely got a nice one look at him go whoa yeah don't come out, don't come out, don't come out. He wants to jump. Keep the tension on him. He wants to jump. Oh, there's another nice bass to start the day. Oh, wow, I told you there's some nice one in here. Oh, let's get this guy up here. Oh, look at the size of this guy. Oh, beautiful. Oh, he's trying to jump in the boat. Come here. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. That's how you start the day, guys. That is how you start the day. Wow. <sighs> Go 
off the hook. There we go. That's on that blue flake. Big one right there. I'm gonna say it may be about five pounds. Yeah, so I got this little electronic scale off of Amazon. These were Paula grippers. And then what I'll do is just put them on the hook here. Lift it up, lift it up. We'll turn it on so we're getting the weight with the grippers on it at zero. All right, let's lock it in. And let's see, what do you guys think? Looks like four, four point two seven. Nice one though. Four point two seven, guys. Boom! Look at that <laughs> chunky monkey here in the morning. Boom! Thank you, buddy. Let's get you back out there. Ready to go? Haha! <laughs> there we go. 